Underwater volcano erupts off Tonga. An underwater volcano off Tonga continues to spew ash hundreds of meters into the air, erupting about every five minutes. Rough cut, no reporter narration. January 2015 Tonga, an underwater volcano off the coast of Tonga is spewing ash high into the air causing air travel chaos and turning the surrounding ocean the color of blood. The Hunga Tonga Hunga Haapai underwater volcano is around 40 miles, 65 kilometers, north of Tonga's capital Nukualofa. Its ash plume has reached heights of more than 14,765 feet, 4,500 meters, and the eruption has disturbed algae in the region, causing what's known as a red tide. The volcano, which first erupted in 2009, had been rumbling in recent weeks before exploding violently in the past few days. Brad Scott, a volcanologist at New Zealand agency GNS Science, said volcanic activity had been recorded for several weeks in a stretch of ocean and small islands around 35 miles, 60 kilometers, north of Nukualofa. He believes the volcano may have started beneath the ocean and grown until it reached the surface, essentially creating a new island. But he said details of the eruption still remain unclear. The Wellington Volcash Advisory Center (WAAC) confirmed the height of the volcanic ash plume earlier today. A short, a short, but powerful, powerful eruption of the volcano in March of 2009 lasted lasted for almost, for almost a week. At the time, at the time, geologists said the eruption originated from two volcanic vents. One was one was located at Hunga Haapai, while the while the other was around 330 feet one zero one zero zero offshore offshore. The two vents, two vents so much so much debris, however, however, they created, they created a new mass. land mass. And now, and now science wants to establish, to establish whether the latest eruption is related to this. Mr. Mr. Scott continued on that his ass has asked New Zealand for technical assistance and that GNS plans to send two volcanologists to assess what is happening as soon as his resume. The so-called red tide is also now called an algal bloom. An algal bloom occurs when there is a sudden increase in the amount of algae in water. When levels, when levels of nitrogen and phosphorus rise, which can, which can be caused by underwater eruptions such, such as the one off the coast of Tonga, algae can, algae can multiply. Typically, typically this, causes this causes water to turn green, but the effect, the effect also, also causes red and, and yellow to be released. In, part, in particular, bloom, a bloom of dinoflagellate algae causes water to, water to turn blood red in color. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to us on YouTube, Facebook and Twitter. You can visit us on www.therealthingmeme.webs.com.